Hey guys and welcome to a new video of Bitcoin Edge. Today we'll take another look at the markets and um, some interesting stuff happened. Um, the S&P 500 completely flat, going sideways, very bullish. Um, the Dixie came back for a retest over here. Right now it's dumping a little bit. Um, so yeah, this is what we are having on the Dixie. Why is the Dixie important? We always look at the Dixie. Um, big bull markets happen when the dixie goes down the current bull market dixie goes down 2017 bull market dixie goes down so that is why the dixie is important over here we have the dixie as well um i wanted to look at the s p 500 but we already saw it just goes sideways not important um the parabola also the premiums and discounts over here um with funding um looking very good you know uh, when when fin fundings and premiums are high you know um you got to be careful because liquidity is to the downside. That is usually how that works in a bull market. It can stay positive for a long time. But over here, you know, if it's negative, uh, it's an easy buy. You can see that over here as well. You know, it went negative. Rational people started shorting. And then, I mean, stuff just goes up. That's how that works. We squeeze them up. What did we see today? We saw um, this is the line. This blue line is exactly what I was drawing like in my last video. Uh, and it came out perfectly. This little retest over here. They didn't even do a fake out over here like I expected. Uh, usually they run some stops like to go below this, like below this previous high. Um, but they didn't even do it. Or maybe they did it on Bitmax or Bybit. I'm not sure. Uh, but um, anyway, we're looking very good over here. Um, right now we are at a place where rational people are shorting it. Um, that seems to be the case as well. Let's take a look over here at the fundings and premiums. Uh, we had, what is it, a $40, $30 uh, premium on BitMEX. Not even that bad. How are the fundings looking? Let me refresh it. Uh, predicted funding is coming down on Bybit. And predicted funding also coming down on BitMEX. Meaning people are becoming less bullish over here. I get that. I get that. Um, but that's why we keep pumping. Also, this is a lot driven by um, <clears throat> spot markets, uh, people buying with real new fresh fiat on Coinbase. Um, so that is very good. Taking a look at Ethereum. Let me pull the chart up. Ethereum also doing very good over here. Um, what I was drawing last night, this was uh, resistance over here and they broke it. Um, very good, very good. Um, Next up is this one over here. That's around 1260 and after that it is $1300. And yeah, after that it's basically this top over here, which already basically is the all-time high. Depending on what exchange you're looking at, you know, what the all-time high is for um, Ethereum. On Bitstamp it was somewhere around $1400. On Coinbase I believe it is $1500. Um, so yeah. Um, that is kind of it. Um, looking very good over here, Ethereum. Let us take a look at Ethereum BTC over here. Also, well, 3% up today. Looking kind of good. Um, we're on the hourly chart, but they clearly broke that one. Very good. Did a retest on this trend line. We need to zoom out a little bit. Um, but I expect them to break to the yearly highs and um, so yeah if you, if you want to like in a bull market you know if you want to take some risk I think Ethereum is a better buy now than Bitcoin if you want a bit a bit less risk you buy Bitcoin that's as simple as that uh, I also always trade with leverage so if you're a hodler you know don't start trading with leverage because you'll lose money uh, it's as simple as that if you do trade with leverage make sure you sign up under this buy bit link um, and you get rewards. You get, if you deposit, um, 1.5 BTC, um, which is a lot for many, I think, um, you get $500 deposit bonus. But if you deposit a bit less, you know, you also get a, a bonus and there are some other giveaways as well in the rewards hub. Um, like you can at least earn, I think, and if you do all the things, you know, like it's really easy to catch like $50 on the rewards hub. Uh, so make sure you sign up under this link over here it's also in the video description use the code jackpot in uh, the rewards hub but just sign up first um, go to rewards hub and then it will all be very clear to you um, if you have questions about it let me know 
with this link you also get 20% discounts on your trading fees which is a lot so bitcoin we saw that what else is an interesting alt guys what do you like let me take a look if you guys want me to take a look at um, at alts you know um, always send me a message i'm always happy to take a look af is breaking out we were taking a look at that earlier and they broke out we took a look into that earlier and it break out and it's in price discovery fairly clearly they made a really big rising wedge over here and on a smaller time frame you could see over here they were making a rising wedge as well and broke up to the upside i think this will at least go to 250 dollars uh, what else is an interesting altcoin for you guys let me take a look you can always let me know in the comments um, dot is kind of hot at the moment i believe but it's breaking out already cream is also breaking out whoa 25 percent let's take a look at cream to the daily well 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 did this break out yes or no let's go to the four hour maybe shows a little bit more And yeah, I mean, it's breaking out. We'll go to the highs. A uh, chart is very young. So that means there is not a lot to, to draw about on yet. You know, just because the chart is so young. Let me know in the comments what coins you would like to see. Uh, there's not much to draw over here. They're making higher highs. Very bullish. Uh, these are resistances and they will probably go there. Uh, that's what I think. Uh, I show my trades as well on Twitter. Um, let me check. <laughs> I had a very good trade today. Um, it was really funny. It started over here. Uh, I woke up, longed it over here, you know, and this retest just under 38k. And um, yeah, well, let's take a look. Here we broke out. I was still long. Here I had 240% PL, and that's where we almost were at 40k. It was really funny. I'm still in the trade. Um, and like I said, smart people, rational people would short it over here. And that's exactly why you're not shorting it. Because those will end up buying the top, aka their stop being hit at the top. Uh, so we're going to 50k, 60k at least, I think. Within 24 hours, I expect new all-time highs. Um, so yeah, that is about it. Make sure to follow me on Twitter. Also, if you trade with some leverage like I do, make sure you use one of these sign-up links. Uh, alts are good for FTX. Um, also, 20% discount. Really cool. Really cool discounts. You know, on trading fees, really save uh, you money. So make sure you use those. Um, and that is about it for today. Let me know what you think and make sure to subscribe, leave a like, leave a comment. And uh, I see you guys again. Well, if there's a lot of action later tonight. Bye, guys.